So determine if Ki, that's potassium iodide, is acetic, basic, or neutral when we put it in water. We'll use these rules here. So to use the rules, the first thing we need to know is we have a base here, potassium hydroxide, and then this hydroiodic acid, Hi. When these neutralize, we get Ki. That's the salt. So we need to know the strength of the potassium hydroxide and the hydroiodic acid before we can use these rules to figure out whether Ki is acetic, basic, or neutral. So let's take a look at this table here. And this shows us that if we're looking for first KOH right here, potassium hydroxide, that is a strong base. So I'm gonna write SB for strong base. HI right here, hydroiodic acid, that's a strong acid. So I write SA up here. So you have a strong base plus a strong acid. They're neutralizing. We get our salt, the Ki, plus water. Now we can use our rules. So if we have a strong base and a strong acid, the pH will be neutral at seven. So in answer to our question, is Ki acetic, basic, or neutral? It should be neutral when we put in water according to these rules here. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.